Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel, and I know I've been neglecting the whole, like, beauty scene. Um, I've just been super busy, and I know I say this every time, but I apologize. Um, so I decided to come up with a series of Naked 2 palette looks, and also Naked palette looks. But I'm going to be starting off with the Naked 2 because it is the newest, and I, it's just what I've been loving lately. Um, so yeah, like I said, I will be using the Naked 2 uh, palette in this look. And I also explain dupes, um, if there is any that I know of, and just to help the ones that don't have the palette. Um, it is amazing, I do recommend it, and honestly I would say that I like it better than the actual Naked palette. Um, but, yeah, so this one is just basically a simple everyday school work look um, it's quick and easy and I think it's very very neutral um, you could probably tell that I don't really have a lot going on um, but I will do a dramatic look and stuff like that if you guys have any request um, or anything any certain color that you want me to do in the palette just let me know and I would love to do that so yeah, let's get started and I hope you guys like this. It's a three step process. It's really easy. So this eye is done and as you can tell it is a very, very simple, um, very neutral naked eye I guess you could say. Um, so yeah, we're going to get started with this eye. This eye is already primed with Urban Decay Primer Potion. So we're just going to get started. This is really, really simple. Like I said, um, we're using the Naked 2 palette. And the first color we're going to be starting off with is called Foxy. It is a matte skin tone color. You can also use Brulee from MAC or Wet n Wild's Brulee. Anything like that. Just a matte skin, cone, uh, skin tone color um, will work well. Now I'm just going to be taking this with a big brush because we're going to be putting this all over the eyelid and all the way up to the brow. And I'm just making sure that I have a good enough layer that you can tell that it's not just my skin. The next color we're taking is pretty hard to dupe, um, but it is this color called Tease. And it is just a matte, um, brownish, mauve purplish color, um, if that makes any sense. If you own the palette, you know what I'm talking about. Um, but it's pretty hard to dupe. Um, I wish I could find it in single form of, even by Urban Decay, because I would so buy it. But yeah, that's it right there. With a crease brush, this one is, uh, Sigma's Blending E25. <clears throat> Don't mind my voice, I just woke up a little bit ago. Um, and we're basically going to put this in the crease. This is going to be the hardest part of this look, um, is trying to blend it. Um, but honestly, that isn't even hard. So just put it in your crease and just blend. The next uh, step that we're going to do is be taking a shimmery highlight color and is, is the third one in the palette is called Booty Call and basically it's just a shimmery highlight color and we're taking this in the inner corner. And honestly, putting a shimmery skin tone color into your inner corner every single day will brighten your eyes up and make it look so much better. So I do this every single day. Not necessarily with this color. You can take any like um, CoverGirl's Shimmering Sands Trio, the lightest color, just stuff like that.
So basically that is it with the eyeshadows. Now I'm just going to curl my lashes and put on mascara on the top and bottom lashes. Um, you can go ahead and put eyeliner on if you want, but I just feel like this is more neutral and just stuff like that and it's a lot easier. And the mascara that I'm going to be using is Benefit's Bad Gal. Um, I got this in a little kit and I am really, really loving this. Um, I don't know if I'd pay full price for it, but I really do like it. So this is the finished look. Like I said, it's very, very, very simple, and yeah, I hope you guys like it, and I will talk to you guys very soon. Stay tuned for my next Naked 2 palette look. Bye!